Be yourself. I am waiting for the day where you don't have to come out. You can love who you want and be accepted. I know we're far from that and I still feel the fear of letting no words I'm gay slip my lips. I know there will be still prejudice and discrimination. I mean we are a judgmental human race. You'll be lying to yourself if you say you never judge someone based on their looks, the way they acted, spoke and more. But we need to be taught tolerance, acceptance and respect at a much younger age. In the future, I want the same reaction of when I say I'm 15 to when I say I'm pansexual. I don't want there to be stares, the looks, the judgmental words and sayings. All because of one thing about myself. Being pansexual doesn't define me and it doesn't define anyone. Just like being a Virgo, just like being 15, just like having blue eyes. Those don't define me or you. All these small things together make me, but they don't singly define who I am as a person. I see myself as kind, caring and thoughtful. Yes, I might have a lot of insecurities, self-hate, but I try to put others before me. And I try and help. I try and make something with the one life I have been granted with. I try not to let the stares, the judging and the question get to me, but sometimes they do. And I want to stop that in the future. I want to walk outside, get on with my life, smile and not feel like I have a big arrow on my head that says vulnerable, a target. Like being pansexual or being who I am is something to be targeted at. Nobody should be targeted at. It shouldn't matter if you're gay, trans, non-binary, black or anything. It shouldn't matter. The only thing that should matter is how you treat others and how you view yourself and live in society. It is acceptable to hate a murderer but not someone because of their colour of skin. It is acceptable to hate a paedophile but not someone for being transgender. It is acceptable to be who you are and people shouldn't be so judgmental or disrespectful. It's scary to think about all the fear people have for just being gay or trans. It's scary to think that people are scared to leave the house because they're scared to be hassled in the streets just because of the way they look. It's scary to hear in the news about shooting and attacks based on prejudice. It is scary to express who you are sometimes. But you know what? You shouldn't hide it. You shouldn't hide who you are. You should express who you are and be yourself. And yes, I know it can be scary, but you'll feel so much more happier being you and blocking out all the judgmental Horrible people who name call you, stand up for yourself. Stand up for yourself. Be you, be proud and care for yourself and others. Treat others as you wish to be treated. Because this will teach others that it is okay. There is still hope in the world. That one day it won't be weird if you see a male wearing a skirt outside. It won't be weird to see gay couples kissing in the street. It'll be normal. They won't just be gay marriage, it'll just be happy marriage. You don't have to define something based on who they like. It won't be weird to see unsegregated areas where multicultural are mixing together, living in harmony. This may be in the future, but it don't mean hide who you are now and show yourself later. The quicker and earlier you accept yourself, 
the more likely other will learn that it's okay and normal. The quicker the future will come. So be yourself and don't let others control who you are.